vacation. All packed up, ready to go. Feel bad for SJ, he doesn't know what's happening. There's our bags. We're actually pretty excited because we're taking a cruise with my grandmother and if you remember, just three weeks ago she had a heart attack and five stents put in and now she is doing 110% better. She's fired up, ready to go on a vacation. And so the three of us came up with this idea about six months ago that we should take a cruise together because we've traveled a lot in the past and uh, we need to keep this old girl active and going. And so we are going on a cruise. So we're packed up, ready to go. We're flying to Fort Lauderdale tonight on a red eye. And we're gonna spend two days in Fort Lauderdale and then we're catching a boat Sunday for 10 days through the Panama Canal. Should be fun. Right, Erica? Right. Come on, show some excitement. You never do. And yet I work full time. And even when I was working and and he wasn't, he still didn't do anything. <laughs> he didn't do a damn thing. See how lucky you are, Erica? That's why right? I love you. That's why I married you. Because I do everything around the house. I do all the cooking, cleaning. Cooking? Linen. When do you ever clean or cook? Anyways. I have a maid, okay? And who pays for it? Moi. Your one and only expense. So, so we made it through uh, airport security rather quickly be because Nan had the benefit of the wheelchair. Uh -huh. I think we're going to start taking her on a few more vacations because we just breezed right through in five minutes. <laughs> and we're having some cat's eye over here. It's yeah. pretty good. And there's our plane right there, our Delta. Our Delta. Delta. Our Delta. Is, is it a wide body? Oh, it's a big body, Nan. A real wide one. It's got two aisles. Yeah, we got right on. Pre-boarding. We're the uh, first one on the airplane. Yeah. So we made it to Florida, and we thought, let's rent a car for one day because. Connecting to OnStar. Hi, Erica. What's OnStar call has ended. It's like a Chevy assistance. So anyways, we thought we'd rent a car because we're going to try and go do an alligator farm and it's going to be less expensive to rent a car versus taking a taxi there and back. So there we are. Going gator hunting. <laughs> we're tired. We got in a couple hours. We haven't gotten a room because the reservation wasn't done properly. No, it was done properly, but... It wasn't. We were supposed to Nan get... got her room and she kicked us out. She said, you know what? I need to go to sleep and take a nap. So leave. She kicked us out of the room. And we don't get our room for a few more hours. So we rented a car and we thought, what shall we do? Let's go out to the Everglades and let's go look for some gators. So we're going... We're going gator. alligator hunting. Gator, gator. I've been looking for a Starbucks. Yeah, you're really gonna find one here. There's no Starbucks in sight. Yeah. So there's like one car in, one car out. Well, look at us. We got ourselves a recreational vehicle out here. We are yeah. on our boat, ready to go. Surgeon Brigaders. Basically the boat that we're on. The one that's parked in front of us. Just like the one we're on here at the oh, sawgrass. I'd like to mention to you before we leave, cap anything loose, don't be careful of them, they can't be blown off. If they go through that top, well, they ain't gonna look the same when they come out. They don't fit for the food either. So be careful of that.
there's the crocodile. No, they're not crocodile. What am I saying? We're out looking for gators. If one was like right there and it just came jumping up, you know? Up to 16 feet long, can live up to 60 years of age. There's our uh, second gator. There's one there, there's one over there. You break jerky, probably. I say I'm pretty sure this is female. They don't come out and help, but they stay back in the grass. They're off the white shine. This surprises me. What do you think? We uh, we saw three alligators and they said that was pretty good. Most of the time they only see one, maybe two alligators, so. And it was like attacking us. <clears throat> no, it was smelling. I had the beef jerky. Smelling Erica's beef jerky. So, it was fun. It was it definitely, definitely worth it. Yeah, it for, for 20 bucks a person, half hour, and then we get a. <laughs> maybe I have a fucking worm in the leg. <laughs> Look, those are dangerous. They so what are they? die. They're venomous. <laughs> it's not gonna kill you, baby. It is. It's just a little bug. Don't don't hurt it. It's on my leg. <laughs> you freaked out. Uh, <laughs> I could have died. What if I die, baby? Look at your ears. Bugs. Oh. You're kind of in the middle there. Oh uh, no, there ain't no middle, don't <laughs> <laughs> We're right between Buffalo, Toronto, and. Oh Detroit, man. So. How do you determine the sex? Is that a girl? Probably. Yep. Because there's nothing there. Oh, it's not usually a deer fly. Oh, cool. Yeah. Those are pain in the butt. They will not stop until you kill them. Like horse fly, you can like shoot them away. Oh, deer fly, it'll just keep coming back, keep trying to bite you. They'll bite you more than once, too. They get hard. And they'll chicken. I got the chicken. Yeah. Now, but listen, as he starts to chomp and stuff, now the other thing that might happen is you might get one or two grabbing on you. Yours are just big, there you go. Look. You're usually going to go after. Not yours are much bigger than their own head. Because as you can see, they swallow a hole. So you see he had to tear off a chunk. Of course, the little guy's got this here. You can see he's trying. So you can see that a couple of them grab it there. Whether it's sushi, raw vegetables, raw fruit, juice, you start cooking stuff, it changes the way the inside of the grill down as well as in the water. Oh, wait. Oh. That's a piece. Do you think he's going to chew the whole thing in? Probably. 
Damn.